guys, it's your urban herbivore, and it is in the morning, and I'm getting ready to eat a wonderful breakfast. So this is day one, and I just wanted to show you some of the things that I've put on my plate to start my day. All right, guys, this is my breakfast for day one. I have some watermelon, some oranges, cantaloupe, apples, blueberries that are hidden inside, some peaches. Um, I have some mixed nuts, which consist of... Um, walnuts, pistachios, and almonds. And what's sprinkled on top is um, milled flax seeds for some added fiber. Um, this is going to be a really good um, nutritional breakfast for me to start the day. And um, I'm looking forward to my snack and my lunch because they're going to be just as big as this. I mean, look at that. There's nothing wrong with overcrowding your plate with wonderful fruits wonderful colors. It's going to start your day. Anyways, I'm ready to dive in. Okay guys, what I'm doing right now is I'm preparing my salad for my lunch. This is about six cups of spinach, uh, kale, and romaine lettuce. And then for the rest of the week, I like to cut up all the lettuce and take the time and break it up into bite-sized pieces, wash it, spin it, and then place it in a bigger container for the rest of the week so I can just grab and go. So like I said, I have spinach, kale, and I'm about to add the romaine lettuce to the container. And it's a pretty big one. And what I do is I line the bottom with a paper towel to absorb all the excess water. And it helps it from breaking down a little bit faster as well. So make sure you prep, 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 because that's really going to help you in the future, you know, for the rest of the week when you're on the go. And it also, you know, saves you a lot of time. So, like I said, be sure to prep. Alright guys, it's lunchtime. And I found a bigger bowl to put my massive salad in. This is going to be awesome. This is the original bowl. And that's the big bowl. And I also wanted to show you real quick what I'm going to have for my second break, which is at 10 o'clock. You can see I have watermelon, cherries, strawberries, some apples, and this is going to be so good. And I'm going to eat all of this. Mm. And I think the last thing I'm probably going to eat is a banana. So I think that's all I have that I brought. And I'm on my second 20 ounce of water. I'm really trying to increase it, but I'm doing the best I can. And so far I've gone to the restroom like a million times, but this is going to be so good. Good. Look at that. Look at that. Alright, I need to go. Hey guys, um, I just want to tell you real quick that so far, um, for at least a good half of my day, everything that I've eaten as far as breakfast and my snacks, I've been feeling so energized and I've been feeling so good. Um, usually I'd be drinking a cup of coffee or two by now and I'm surprised that I'm not sleepy. I'm not feeling lethargic or anything, and I think it really has to do with what I'm eating. And here's a TMI moment. Um, <laughs> my bowel movements have been moving a lot. Like, I swear I've been to the restroom at least maybe three or four times within the last 24 hours, and everything is just going right through me. And I think it's just because of the really high fiber meals that I've been eating. And it, it you know, surprisingly, you know, it's like I'm. I feel good. I don't feel grossed out or anything, but this is amazing. And I think that's one thing that you'll have to look forward to as you're eating, at least when in week one, is having to go to the restroom quite a bit. Um, and this is going to be a good thing because it's flushing out all those toxins. It's, um, you know, reducing the bloatiness that you'll typically have when you eat like standard processed foods or fast foods. And you'll start feeling lighter on your toes. I mean, it's going to be a slow process, I think, but I think by the end of the week, I'm going to feel fantastic. So I will keep you posted, and I know that was probably too much for me to tell you, but it, it happens to everyone, I believe. So good luck, and eat great. Here, Jasper. You want some broccoli? Good boy. Sammy? 